Hey guys, it's Hetty and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video we're doing part 23 of the Fan Art Feb series and today I'm doing another YouTuber. This one is Lex from Made You Look and she's got a beauty slash body painting channel. She does actually have three channels now, I think. There's Made You Look Twice, which mainly focuses on like makeup and then she has a cooking channel that she's just put out where she does really simple recipes. But I mainly watch her main channel which is just Made You Look and for this piece, um, she posted a picture on her Instagram and did a video about it. Um, it's like the no filter picture, so she's got no makeup on and there was no filters or anything, even not even the best lighting, and she posted it just showing that she's got acne, she's got bags under her eyes, red eyes, and freckles and uneven skin, and so what? And in her video about it, she talks about there's so many youtubers that are like over filtered and they put too much makeup on to hide all their imperfections because everyone has to be perfect or like you got to have the, the perfect eyebrows and stuff like that and she's just you don't need it no she tries to get a message across as much as possible to tell people that you're beautiful anyway no matter how you look to yourself other people will see you as beautiful yes there's going to be haters but let them hate as long as you're happy in your own skin, don't hide it. Be um, makeup should be used to emphasise your natural beauty, not to hide any of your imperfections. So I, that's one of the reasons why I really like her channel, because she gives out a really good message, especially to young kids. She really does try to aim towards getting young kids to understand makeup is a lovely thing to have and know how to do, but you don't need it. It is just something that's it's like a talent to have so don't force yourself to have it because and you don't have to wear it all the time so yeah it's, it's pretty good i'll leave a link to her channel in the description below um but yeah i have some more questions to answer for today and the questions come from i think her name's fictional jen but it's jen anyway and the first question she asks is what anime what mangas and animes have you read and watched um, I have watched a lot of anime and read a lot of manga. Not so much the recent stuff, but I have watched quite a lot. I mean, I've got a list up on my computer at the moment on the anime website, and I can go through and pick out maybe nearly half of them. Probably not so much anymore because I haven't watched the last two or three seasons worth of anime that's come out just because of having a child. But yeah, there's a lot of the old ones I've watched and the classics like Naruto, Bleach, um, Katakyo Hitman Reborn. Um, I haven't seen One Piece. I started to watch it, but it's not something that interested me. So I tried, I didn't really watch that. And I haven't seen like Hunter x Hunter. I know that one was a big one, but I've seen a few of the little ones. I've seen most of the Studio Ghibli films and stuff like that. So I have watched quite a lot. And as for manga, um, again, I've read quite a few of them, but some of the ones I'm reading at the minute is um, Kami-sama Hajime Mashite, which I think that translates to like, I Met a God or something, but that one's a pretty good one. Um, the main girl in it meets the Earth God and becomes the Earth God or something like that, a Land God, that's the one. And it's about a relationship between her and his, his familiar so which becomes her familiar but that was quite a good one and then there's like the uh, food wars shokugeki no soma um i've watched the anime to that and i haven't watched season two though that's come out last year i think it was but i'm reading the manga to that and then there's tokyo ghoul which again i've watched the animes to those as well and i do like it even though it doesn't match the manga but it's just one to watch to pass the time mainly but i do like that i'm really loving the manga of that uh citrus um Attack on Titan, which I've also seen the anime to that, and I watched the live action film, but let's not even go there with that because, ugh, no. And I am actually trying to read the new Naruto ones, which is Boruto, but I'm also reading Arjean, which I've seen the series on Netflix as well. That's a really good series, I do recommend that one. Um, Black Butler, um, I love that one as well. So that's a few of them if that gives you a hint. I kind of read a mix of everything so I don't 
I probably couldn't even go through all of them because that's yeah there's not really one particular th um genre I like either I like most and uh, next question is favorite Pokemon um I only really know the original Pokemon and the classics um and my favorite out of that one I think it was probably Togepi but yeah I didn't I'm not an overly big um Pokemon fan so I can't really answer that one very well I'm not really a fan of the newer series at all I tried watching a few episodes but I was like no no thank you but the next question is favorite piece in your fan art feb collection so far Ooh. I'm gonna have to have a look on my computer at all of them. Let's see. I really like the way Amethyst turned out. So that one's pretty nice. Um I think it might be my spirited away piece. Hmm. It's between Spirited Away and Peridot actually. Between Spirited Away and Peridot. I really like those two. And my phone keeps buzzing in my hand. <laughs> But I think, yeah, those two are probably my favourites. I can't really choose between which, but anyway, that's all the questions I have for today. And we're coming up to the end of the video now, so thank you for watching. I hope the questions are answered okay for you. If you want a more detailed answer to the anime I've seen, I suppose I can do a video on that. Because there's a lot, but, or any I'd recommend. And same with manga, I guess. But anyway, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I will see you. Oh, wait. Tomorrow we have a special video. I'm doing a collaboration tomorrow, so look forward to that one. I'm not going to spoil who it's with, but I hope you actually come and join us for that collaboration. And yeah, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow for the next video. Bye.